Okay, okay, I didn't move anything. This is how I found it. No. Yeah. No. Yeah. If you've watched our last two videos, you know that driving from Panama to Colombia is completely impossible since there are no roads through here, the Darien Gap. That meant we had to get creative to get both us. Yesterday we came here on these boats. And our tiny home on wheels across the border to Colombia. So here's what we did. We put our home in a cargo ship. Man, this is really crazy. I can kind of see the van a little bit through this fence but not really. Then we hit up San Blas Adventures to help us get across the border and hit a few spots along the way. What do you think of that, babe? Oh my God, it was amazing. You missed like the biggest fish. We're just gonna go a little beer in the water pool. Oh, it's so nice. After four days in literal paradise, we arrived in Colombia, but we were still 10 hours away from where our van was going to land. So we hopped on this boat, then got into this van, then boarded this bus, and finally. Good morning from an Airbnb, everybody. Today is the van pickup day. For all we know, everything could be stolen. It's just about all Aubrey's thought about since we dropped off the van. How you doing, my little baby? I'm so scared. I'm what? like legitimately not just playing this out for YouTube. Like, I'm actually so nervous about it. Yeah? Yeah. What are you nervous about? That like, it's just the thing is like all of our stuff is in one spot. Yeah? Like, if they figured out how to get one thing out, they figured out how to get all of it out. Right. You know? Right. Oh my goodness. Ah, oh my goodness. I know it's not. Like, there's like a 0.0000001% chance. But like, what if it's at the bottom of the ocean? It's not. Okay, but like. It's not. Okay. It's like for sure in Cartagena. For sure in Cartagena. Okay. Oh my god. Come on, we need to get up and go check it out, man. Okay. You're not going to learn anything about your van while you're sitting in an Airbnb. Okay. No stress eating Oreos. You so nervous? Yeah. What are we waiting on? The ship, I think, is here. But there's a lot of processes and things that they have to go through before the van is ready for us to actually pick up. And so we're just waiting on our, like, a notification from our agent in Panama City to let us know that the van is ready to be picked up. And then we start the process that we've heard could be a day and a half, could be a day. We don't know how long it's gonna take. Evelyn just emailed me back. She says, hello. I just checked it on marine traffic. Looks still at Cartagena port working. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Please call to check availability here. And then gave a place and a number and everything. What did they say? So they said they're unloading and yeah. asked if we could start paperwork. Oh, okay, so we're waiting. waiting. Yes. Okay. Wait, so we can. Still waiting. What's, still waiting. Still waiting. Well, how are we? <laughs> Sebastian's ready for a party. <laughs> okay, let me do a bit of explaining here. We wanted to save a couple hundred bucks and do this without an agent. So we had to learn the ins and outs of this process as we went. After hours of waiting on one guy to email us very slowly, our Espanol speaking amiga called him. Hola, buenos dias, Sergio. Sergio. Hola, it's Hanelin. So, we send him all of those documents that he requested. Yeah. Then, they're gonna work on the bill of lading, like to make it official or whatever they have okay. to do. Tomorrow, they were gonna send us the invoice. Whoa. So like, I feel like she should have told us we could have done this before. Yeah. Like, I feel like we could have done this yesterday. Yeah, we definitely could have done this yesterday. Shoot. Yeah. So we can't start anything with customs until we have this. Until we have this. So. This sucks. Our van is just sitting in the port, yeah. getting robbed. All we need to do, we have cash. We can go in, we can hand them cash. We can get our keys, we can drive it away. It's going to be two more days of this. That's so stupid. Good morning, day two squad members. We have a problem. We, the Matneys, have things moving, shaking, and grooving. We have our invoices. We can move forward. Right. But for some reason, 
they don't have theirs mm. and apparently What's they're not going to get theirs for another like six hours this guy said it was going to take a really long time mm-hmm. yeah we just need to well stay no but on he said ass. he was going to get us ours in the morning which I he know. did but he we just need to stay on his ass I think we're right on his ass, babe. I know. I know. I'm just saying we just need to stay on it. We yeah, need to be, no like, squeezing it, you know? No one's disagreeing. He needs disagreeing. to, like, feel our breath on his shoulders. Whoa. We're, like, right Whoa. on his ass. I was super optimistic that this on the ass staying would get the invoice made faster, but unfortunately, I was wrong. After seven hours, wow. we finally have our invoices. It is 4.25 p.m. Everything is closed, so this day was wasted. And it's dumb because we haven't even started. Like, it's not that it takes three days. Have you ever heard something goofier than this? I know this is totally irrational, but like, my biggest thought was like, you guys, your van was so much harder to get into, and ours obviously was not. And what if like, ours got cleared because they got all of our shit out? And your guys just didn't because they couldn't get your shit out. It was four o'clock in the afternoon. <laughs> but now we have all the shit, so go for it. Well, we're gonna go make some copies. We, we're doing literally every scrap of ridiculous task that we can do today. <laughs> like stuff we don't even need to do, just because we want to feel productive. So, see you in the morning again. Buenos dias. Buenos dias, my baby. How are you? I'm ready to get my house. Day three. Today is, you know, victory day, I think. <laughs> That's what we're hoping for. Exactly. Let's make it victory day. I'm hoping for victory day. Step one. Are you ready? I'm so ready. So this is where we can finally, after two and a half days, pay our <laughs> port fees. And start the process. Some of our port fees. Let's start. <laughs> I don't want to jinx anything, but that went as well as it could have, so. Karate kidding this. Day. I know, seriously. Let's go. We just finally got the paper that we need to get our vehicle permit so we can drive in the country. So we are heading right now in a taxi to see our vans. I'm really nervous. I'm so nervous. I see sprinters over there though. Yeah, it's a lot. Oh, I see them now. It's like an army Yeah, that's army. Like a company thing. Let's go see if we can get our bins. They're not letting me or Henry go in because our names aren't on the titles. Pretty classic, huh? Yeah, classic. Pretty classic. So, power move. <laughs> mucho power move. Mucho. Yeah, super power move. Um, so Christian and Hanlon are in there getting the vans and Christian has promised me that he is not going to look into the van until I'm there so we can both see it together. Um, Henry, what do you think are the chances that everything is stolen out of our van specifically? Ooh, your van specifically. Because uh, to be honest, I'm feeling a lot better about your van. Mm, I'd say there's like a 15% chance. That everything's stolen out of ours? Yeah. That's it? That's it. Okay, okay, I'm feeling good then. Because yeah. I feel like it's probably a 70% chance. Whoa, that is a very <laughs> high chance. I'm not feeling very confident. More credit. Come on now. Okay, what about your van? Is it different chances? No, it's probably the same. Probably the same? Oh, I feel wow. like if people want something, they'll uh-huh. figure it out. So, okay. 15%. And we've given them plenty of days to do it. Exactly. <laughs> if you haven't done it by now, you just suck. You suck. Okay, so now we just wait. These two come back completely drenched because it's raining so hard and they're like, sorry, it didn't work. Uh, apparently, there's like other fees that we just realized we didn't pay. We have to go to another bank. So Henry and I are going to another bank to pay these fees. Taxiing. Taxiing to another bank to pay these fees while these two stay here. The second we get it paid, we're going to send them a picture of the invoice. And then they're hopefully going to get the van and come pick us up at the bank. Right. That's the point. Right, right, right. There are literally 20 steps to this. Okay, so shit got wild here at the end and there was a little time for filming. So let me catch you up on what was going on. The port closed at 6 and Henry and I left to go to the bank at 4.30. Because of traffic, we did not arrive to the bank until 5.10. We went as fast as we could and got them proof of payment at 5.45. So now we wait. This was our our job and now it's up to them. I received this text. So Henry and I taxied back to the Airbnb to wait for them to arrive with the van. We just got here to the Airbnb. Unfortunately, we don't have a key, so we're stuck out here waiting until the vans are all up. Uh, Pacing back and forth. Yeah. Can't handle it. 
Oh my word. They should be here any minute. As long as nothing worse happens. We're not gonna think about that. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. We got it home. Oh Whoa. my god. So, yeah. I haven't seen all of it yet. Yeah. I left some of it left to see. Okay? Okay. Are you ready? Yeah. It's gonna be all right, okay? Okay. Oh okay. no. All right, come on. Okay, I didn't move anything. This is how I found it. No. Yeah. No. Yeah. No, this is how you found it. This is exactly how I found it. Wow. Do we have our sun bomb? Do we in the top? There's no sun bomb in here. No, they took our sun bomb. No, dude, but I think we like. I think we must have put it back. Okay, there. okay, okay. What about the big stuff? I can't open this. Okay, look Still under the mattress. Here. Look under the mattress. We're good. We're good. I think so. Yeah. It doesn't look like they took anything. We'll check the fridge real quick. Make sure. Yes, 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 yes! Okay, well, I, well, okay. The battery's still there. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> <Woo>! <laughs> oh How do you my feel? God. We've got our house back! We've got our house back! We've oh got our house, 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 house back! Just to give you guys some perspective, because we weren't really able to capture it, the front looked terrible. <laughs> Everything was scattered. All our receipts were torn up and out. This was open. Everything knocked down on the ground. Like. What were they even trying to do? I guess they were looking for cash. Uh... Dude, good effing job. Wow. Good f freaking job, man. Wow, dude. Yeah, 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 yeah. Guys, we have our home. We've got our home back. <gasps> That was a wild ride. If you're planning on doing this, I feel like I could do it so much better the second time. Ah, true. So we're gonna put all the information in the description box. If you have any questions, leave a comment. We would love to have a conversation about this because this was a very confusing, stressful process. But at the end of the day, it's very doable. Like, it don't be, be super intimidated by it, but it is complicated. So anyway, info's in the description box. Leave a comment if you have a question about the process. We have a lot of super exciting content coming at you yep. from South America. Um, just to give you a little sneaker peeker, this guy is going away for a couple of weeks. So Easy. for a couple of weeks, I'm going to be experiencing solo female van life and taking you guys along with You that. ready for that? No. It's going to be interesting. If you want to make sure that you don't miss any of those videos, hit the notification bell. All right. And if you're new around here, hit that subscribe button. All right, guys. We'll see you soon. Appreciate you watching. Be good. Bye.